Hi, this is Jeff. Um, so you say you've purchased like an awesome font and you go and install it and then open it up in Photoshop Elements and you start using the type tool to type out something and there's basically no way to view those special characters or glyphs or alternate um, characters that you know are in, um, in the font that you just installed um, in Windows to access those special characters you need to go to your start menu and then type in character you can type in character and it should pop up character map you want to open this up and uh, I've, I've had one open already to this font so I'm working with uh, Lynette and I want to change the L so this is the Windows character map. You can tell that it's like a little bit small, a little bit hard to see. You'll have to scroll through here. And uh, I'm just going to go through and select an L with a, with a stroke through it. You basically want to click on the special character you want, click Select, and then click Copy. Go back into Photoshop Elements, select the character, and then click on control V to paste that in and that will allow you to paste in that special character if uh, Windows character map is too small you can uh, install a free piece of software called Babel map and that looks like this as you can tell it's a little bit bigger a little bit easier to see um, once it opens up it's going to give you a ton of different things so basically you're gonna go through or you're gonna want to select a single font and then select the font that you want or the so font that you're using and then you can scroll through and, and view those special characters and it works kind of the s same way uh, you want to select the character and it'll actually type it into here and then you just click copy and then you can go through and then and then paste it back into Photoshop Elements um, it's unfortunate that Photoshop Elements doesn't have a feature to view uh, glyphs and special characters and such, but um, until they work that out, that's basically how you insert special characters um, into your design. Hope that was helpful. Thanks for watching.